Oh, we got to see that again. We just rolled up to a quick service call. Customers complaining about the gate is not always stopping in the same position. What we have here is an Osco BSGS SLG. I already have a suspicion as to what the issue is, but let me show you what they're complaining about because they sent me photos before I even got out here. They told me that the gate right here uh, sometimes it closes with a two foot gap, three foot gap. Sometimes it slams against the catch there. They have to slams against it and backs up. It's just not stopping always in the same position for the close. Looks look inside one of these things and I suspect it's going to be the limit assembly. Uh, it's something that I've run into before. Osco has always made some really good industrial machines. They already had it unlocked for me. I'm pretty sure this is where we're going to find the problem. Let's run it and find out, huh? Oh, we got to see that again. On this side, you can see basically a duplicate of what's on the back side. The only difference is the axle comes all the way out and has a sprocket for attaching to this limit chain. Well, what happens is this little brass bushing, it'll start slipping and uh, it'll ride up on this notch and then it just basically pulls the axle in and out and in and out and in and out. And so what happens is you never know where the gate's gonna stop in the open or close position. So that's a part that you need to get replaced ASAP. We need to shut this thing down. It's one thing when it stops and leaves a gap, but it's another when it overloads and, and then traps your customers inside the property. So uh, we need to get this entire limit assembly replaced as soon as possible.